C2 shows a very large amount of partial 3. Considering the spectra for both C1 and C2, the pair of partials with the greatest amplitude is clearly 6-3. This chart shows the beat rates at each partial level for each octave type. The partial level that is underlined indicates the one that has the greatest amplitude. We will now examine the octave from C1 to C2 tuned as various octave types, from 4-2 to 12-6. We will use a filter to isolate the beat rates at each partial level for each octave type, starting at the 4-2 level. We will first tune C1 to C2 as a 4-2 octave. We will use a filter to highlight beating at each partial level. As we do so, pay special attention to the beating at the 10-5 and 12-6 levels. The beating at these partial levels prove critical in our concert grand piano example. However, due to increased inharmonicity, the beating in this upright piano is significantly greater, up to 6.5 times a second at the 12-6 level and nearly 4 times a second at the 10-5 level. While we determined that the 6-3 level had the greatest amplitude in this region of the piano, the 10-5 and 12-6 pairs also had amplitudes large enough that these beats would be audible as well. Therefore, the 4-2 octave is not a good choice. We will now tune C1 to C2 as a 6-3 octave. Notice here that tuning C1 to C2 as a 6-3 octave